Welcome to this video that will give you a little insight on what a fieldwork day at Dummy Biological Station looks like for us. We are working on a disease ecology research project by Frauke Ecke that studies the movement behavior of bankvold populations in southern Finland. Bankvolds can carry a variety of diseases, including hunter virus. We wear gloves at all times to prevent any diseases from spreading. On site, we start by checking the traps. As you can see, someone has entered this one. After identifying the species, which in this case is bankroll, we check if the individual is tagged. That means it has entered one of our traps before. Bankrolls can be identified by their bicolored tail as well as their red coloration. The volts are then relocated from their traps into a plastic bag so they can be weighed. After taking the individuals out of the bag, we like to give them some time to get familiar with the situation. We then identify the sex of the bankable individuals. Here we have a male. And this one is a female. Next up, we take a saliva sample using a cotton swab. The samples are then stored in a container which contains a special liquid to preserve them. And that's it! The bank wolves are released back into the wild immediately after sampling. We always make sure to release them close to their initial location, as well as close to a potential hiding spot. As you can see, we put cotton balls in the traps to keep the individuals warm during winter. Any other small mammal species that has entered one of our traps is released right away. These may include, for example, yellow-necked mice, harvest mice and different shrew species. After field work, we take the saliva samples back to the lab, where they are frozen at minus 20 degrees Celsius. They will later be checked for hunter virus. <laughs> 